I came to the hospital because I was COVID-19 positive. When you're a patient, all of a sudden you're, you feel helpless and you feel vulnerable and your you know, belongings are taken away from you and you're put in a gown. You immediately have to give over the sense of control to your healthcare team. And with COVID, I can't see their faces. And so I was even more anxious. As I have reviewed sort of my care, it's those moments of the human connection that really sustained me and got me through. Dr. Grisdell, who was one of my critical care physicians, he came in, he told me his name, that he was my doctor, and that he was gonna take care of me. And that immediately made me feel like I trusted him, that he saw me. And I sort of put myself into a patient's perspective, particularly with PPE, which was just yet another barrier between us and our patients. Being able to see someone's face and making that connection, it goes a long way. Hello, My Name Is was started in the United Kingdom by Dr. Kate Granger. While battling terminal cancer as a patient, she noticed what a huge difference it made when physicians and staff introduced themselves to her before delivering care. Those simple introductions, human connection, and compassionate practice are what makes the Hello My Name Is campaign important. All of us at Vancouver Coastal Health are challenging each other to take part in the Hello My Name Is campaign. Involvement in this campaign is super simple and only involves three steps. Remembering to introduce ourselves to patients, families, and caregivers. Explaining our role and what we'll be doing to help them. And asking the patient, how can I help you to ensure their needs are heard? My hope is that you will join me by doing your part in having these conversations each and every day with patients, families, clients, and residents that you care for. I really value this program because it's a good check for everyone in healthcare, including myself, to have that human connection.